No inventor starts out by saying, I'm gonna invent something so I can get rich. Almost every single inventor says, I just had this question. I wanted to know how something worked and how to fix this problem. And lo and behold, they had this idea that no one's thought of before. One thing that's really important to understand about the Cade Prize is that it is really trying to encourage research to get out of the laboratory into the market, a prize that honors inventors in their early, early stages. We did want to honor and tell the story of inventors, primarily because of our experience with Gatorade through Phoebe's father and my father-in-law. Not just historical inventors, but going forward, how do you tell the story and encourage and inspire future inventors and entrepreneurs? Our focus is on the inventive spirit, if you will. Curiosity, inquisitiveness, problem solving. The K Prize tends to validate the invention for that inventor and it also recognizes that invention for the good that it can do for the community and the world as a whole. This competition provides a great platform for early stage startups to talk about their story, to go and tell your audience what is your technology, what is the mission and vision of your company. Those ideas in their infancy don't look like the next Google. They don't look like the next Apple. They don't look like the next miracle drug. You really have to be there at a critical time for those inventors to kind of help them through that initial process. It's frustrating that they, they have some setbacks. At the time uh, we see these inventions, that prize can be very, very meaningful in allowing the inventor to move to the next step. When I first heard about the Cade Prize, we were at the FAU, Florida Atlantic University Incubator. I got really excited to apply and, uh, and get in front of an audience. My company is Neptunia Ocean Power. We are developing a mixed mode marine energy device that captures wind and wave power and convert that into clean electricity. By winning the Kate Prize, we got a grant that we used to test our prototype in the ocean. This validation was really important for us, and especially coming from an institution like the Kate Museum and the Kate Prize. It also helped us to mention this uh, particular information or the piece of news to our uh, potential investors. So when you go and pitch to investors, we can mention that we have been a finalist in the Kate competition. You know, true inventors and true entrepreneurs realize almost never are you going to think of an idea and the next day you build your little prototype and it works. It's not just the inquisitiveness and the curiosity, but it's the patience and it's the resilience and it's the willing to stick with something often for years. And I, I think that can change lives, it can change individual lives, it can change communities.